Hey, what's going on? My name is Alex with DJ Cut Entertainment, and today I want to cover mastering video meetings and how you can make your brand stand out from the average company. I kind of noticed a trend over the, the last three or four years where I'll, I was getting a lot more phone calls and recently a lot more video chats. Um, my higher profile clients are still doing some meetings downtown, um, but with everything that's kind of going on, the way everything's going is everything is uh, on, on video and streaming. And so you still have that first impression. You still need to make a really good first impression and if your audio doesn't sound good, you don't look good on video, that's your branding and that's how they're they're gonna view you. Um, so you really need to make sure that you master video meetings and that's what's gonna set you apart uh, when it comes to getting higher profile clients and having a higher success rate when it comes to booking uh, different clients. I already know that when I do a video call, my success rate is a lot less than an in-person meeting. So when I used to meet with an uh, in-person client, I don't know if they're just more serious, but my booking rate was uh, you know, up to uh, 90%. And I think an in-person meeting is, is kind of like dating. That person that wants to date you and they'll only go on dates outside their house. They're not as serious, but if they're gonna meet you halfway, you're gonna make them travel and you guys are gonna have a meeting location, you know, I think they're a little bit more serious versus uh, video chat. I mean, you can video chat with like five or six different companies uh, in a matter of minutes, so I don't know if that's it, but I really noticed when I started doing uh, higher video quality, better lighting and audio, that the success rate in my meetings uh, went up a lot higher because I put together a brand that was a lot more professional looking. You know, in these video chats, you don't have the emotion of the person walking into the room. So it's really hard to, to judge what that person's like. And so you really need to set yourself up for success. So when you do a video meeting, everything looks good, they don't have trouble hearing you, and you just have a professional brand that you can put forward. A couple of different components that you need to consider when setting up a good video chat. You need to have good clean audio, you want good lighting and a good camera, but I would say the audio quality and lighting is more important than the actual kind of camera that you're using. The other part of a good video chat is having good notes questions to ask the client and being prepared soon as you get off that chat. So before my video chat even starts, I'm already creating a proposal, a price list, any information that I need to send them. So that way when they get off the phone, I push send, I can send them a message saying, hey, check your email, a proposal has already been sent to you. So that way they're not waiting. So before they can get on another call with another company, they already have my proposal email in their email box, ready to read in case they're ready to pull the trigger right away. Because there's nothing worse than having a phone call and saying, hey, did you get over, did you get a chance to send me a proposal? I wanna be able to send that right away as soon as our video chat is done. So I think video chats are here to stay because you notice everything is going to Uber delivers, Uber eats, groceries in home, and people are getting really custom to stuff brought to them. They don't have to go out and travel. I mean, three or four years ago, I was still, you know, meeting with people in Starbucks. We had an office in downtown Portland and everybody wanted to do in-person meetings. Me personally, I love in-person meetings because I could get a good feel for the personality, how serious they are about booking us for their event. And especially when it comes to, you know, when we're doing high profile, you know, events for Nike and some of our big corporate clients, I really love that in-person uh, communication, bouncing ideas off of each other. But a lot of people are stuck doing video calls, video chats. It's a lot more convenient. And so I want to make sure that I come off as professional and represent our brand the best that I can in our video meetings. So this is the microphone that we use. It goes directly into our computer. And so that way when we do our video chats, we have high quality audio. Uh, we look good on our lighting. Um, and there's no eyesores and no distractions. Really think about what's in your background um, of the place that you're shooting. So that way there's no distractions and they can just focus on the conversation of you 
Um, if you have pets, put them away. Kids, try to keep them in another room. Soundproof your room. So that way it's a professional and it's a good experience. And that way when they get off the call, they're not like, hey, I could barely hear him. Did he say this? Did he say that? There's no confusion. And it just makes your brand stand out that much more. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. I'm Alex with DJ Cut Entertainment.